Hello everyone, how's it going? Derek here from Addictive Tips. In this video, I'm gonna show you how to set up password feedback in Linux. So to start off, you need to make a backup of your sudoers file, and you do that by first accessing the Etsy folder. So do CD Etsy. All right, now from here, you need to escalate your account to the root account. So just do sudo s, enter the password, then you can do <clears throat> cp sudoers and if you just start typing su and then you do sudoers press tab it will auto complete that for you and then sudoers dot back so the second one needs to be sudoers dot back and what this will do is it'll make a copy of this file and set it up as a backup now this is just in case something happens where you lose your file or it gets deleted or, or something while we're working on this that's all we need now from here we can do editor nano Visudo. Now this command will give you access to the sudoers file. Now in the sudoers file we need to locate default env reset and then we add comma pw feedback. Now after that press control o save it out and now we exit the terminal exit again and then we open up a terminal again and if we do sudo s, just as an ex to execute a sudo command, we can see I now have password feedback. So if you've ever used elementary OS, they have this feature enabled by default. This is what it's like to enable it on other Linux distributions. I have gone my entire Linux life, which has been almost 15 years at this point, without this feature. And I honestly didn't think I needed it, but after enabling it, when working on this uh, tutorial for you guys, I don't think I'm ever going to turn it off. <laughs> I have it set up on all my systems now. It's really useful because if you've ever written out some crazy prompt, or uh, you know, a password prompt, you have some crazy long password, you want to know if you're entering it, or if it's even working, you can with this now. So just a quick little guide on how to show password feedback on Linux. I hope you guys like this video, and I hope it was helpful. I will see you in the next one.